final event of the 2016 RC44 Championship, the All Carbon One designs are racing off Malta's famous historic capital, Valletta. Known as the City of the Knights, Valletta is one of the world's most heavily fortified ancient cities. Built on a peninsula with giant vertical ramparts around its perimeter, Valletta has natural harbours on two sides. It was Grand Harbour, the eastern one of these, that today provided the stage for the grand finale of the 2016 RC44 Match Racing Championship. Going into this, the stakes were high and the leaderboard couldn't have been closer. Team Nika and Artemis Racing were tied in the lead, while just three points behind them, three other teams were also tied. Whichever won today between Brunonicech Sailing Team, Team Searef and Team Aqua would most likely pick up the final podium spot in the 2016 Match Racing Championship. After some gruelling battles within the tight confines of Grand Harbour, it all came down to a final race showdown between Artemis Racing and Team Nika. The winner of this was secure the RC44 Match Racing Championship title. Artemis Racing was ahead off the line before a jammed spinnaker sheet on the first run handed the lead to Team Nika. However, on the next upwind, Artemis Racing pulled off a cunning match racing manoeuvre to edge into the lead. This they defended to the finish. For their victory, Artemis Racing was rewarded with the 2016 RC44 Match Racing Championship title. I expected a tough fight and it happened and uh, we won some, we lost some. And uh, sometimes we were lucky, sometimes we were not. For example, we had very big right wing shift at the start with Aqua and they just closed the gap and we didn't expect it and we got a penalty. Really good, really good. Thank you. Really good, Steve. Really good. Very impressive. But what? And it was beautiful to have such a very such a close match uh, with Nika in the last, uh, in the last uh, race. It was uh, really intense. Uh, really like uh, how much race should be, uh, very close, changing the lead all the time and uh, really, really good fun, really good fun. A magical sunset concluded the first day of racing as teams packed up their boats. Tomorrow sees the first of four days of fleet racing here at the RC44 Valletta Cup.